Hello Internet, my name is Jojo Beans, and welcome back to another video. Today we are going to be playing some more Axis and Allies, and today we are going to be doing the Battle of the Lawmain. This is the second mission in the Axis campaign. We have forced the British out of the Mediterranean. Now it is time to take Africa for Germany. We must seize the British fuel dumps, so that our tanks will have the fuel they need to cross the desert. For the Fatherland! So, the biggest issue that you're going to be, or have to be concerned about in this mission is right over somewhere in this area there is a British airfield. Uh, so you do want to make sure that either when you get don't your armor, you division, or your mechanized get moving, division, or I'll take command myself. that you do get anti-aircraft um, troops. Uh, because they will come in extremely helpful in taking down bombers and aircraft. There is, I believe, also an oil refinery uh, somewhere down, oh, right here. Right here, there's an oil refinery with a lot of British troops. And so, I mean, you can work it either way. Either just come up here through the top and go through these lines of British defense with the supply depots, and come up here up top or swing down here which is normally what I will do I'll do a two-pronged attack and send some troops down there to try to take out that airfield we'll just see I might just try to cut through the top is that all I have to do I gotta check oh defeat all enemies so we will have to end up swinging down there anyway. the enemy must be annihilated so let's get that let's go ahead and get a mechanized as well I want to get a armor division as soon as possible to get those tanks attached. Oh, we got another one. Let's see. Find and capture the British oil depots. Clear the railroad of British blockades. Tanks begin this mission unattached. You'll need to build an armory's queue to supply them. Thank you very much. That's what I was just saying. Alright, let's get that unpacked. Let's get these guys. We'll wait for them to resupply. I don't know why those guys decided to do that, but sure. Uh, let's get them start taking out these bunkers. Don't look left or right, only forward. Okay, we need 350 for our armor. Let's go ahead and actually get two supply depots real quick. And anti-aircraft is 125. We're going to take these supply depots and start making our own supply lines, okay, and there's... Oh, yeah, I see you. Go in there and just kind of get massacred by the bunkers and artillery there, but... Sure, whatever works. In the absence of orders, go find something and kill it! And what I actually might do real quick is just pop these in here just to show you. Oh. Well, there's the airfield uh, that I was talking about. Hopefully, they'll actually be able to get some damage uh, done on that airfield. 
I don't know if they'll be able to take it out, but if they could, that would be amazing. Um, well, me and my brother used to call uh, these paper tanks, and you can see why. I mean, just one strafing run, and that tank just shredded. So I very highly doubt they'll be able to fully take it out, but any damage that they can do... They've already gained a level? Are you serious? Oh my word, that's crazy. Okay, um, any damage they can do will be great because when we get the option to spawn them in again, they might be able to fully take it out. I think we can set this one up right here. Without... Triggering the bunker. We'll get our troops in down there. Don't fight a battle if you don't gain and anything. We almost by have enough for our armor HQ. It's not good with infantry like this to bunch them up, especially when attacking an artillery battery because it does splash damage, and so that'll really cut through your troops. But we have so many, thankfully, it's not going to be too much of an issue. I will probably wait, I really want my mortars up here uh, to try to weaken their position over here before we go in and fully commit to the attack. Get moving or I'll take command myself. HQ. We'll research that stuff later, but I want to get these tanks attacked and then... Wait, no way, did they actually do it? Wow, they actually did it. Okay, that's <laughs> that's awesome. That really, that right there is probably the most annoying, hardest part of this whole mission. Is that right there with that airfield? So, I'm I'm really surprised. Like I was not originally. Wow, <laughs> that's gonna make this so much easier um, because I don't think. I certainly hope not, um, that they'll be able to get another airfield. So let's get those guys start working on taking out those positions. Okay, get this unpacked. These will attach, and we can go ahead and send them in as well, now that they can resupply. The enemy must be annihilated! We're going to research both of these once we have enough. Uh, that's going to help out. Our infantry is full, but our mechanized and tank divisions are pretty much open. Wow, I mean, that's great. Because now I don't have to deploy... Okay, what are you Get back and help out. They can, they can run away. Uh, you don't have to deploy anti-aircraft stuff now, so... See, by deploying those tanks right when I did, as you can see here, they have a mechanized division as well. They would have started to deploy mechanized, and see, I think the tanks would have been taken out really before I was would have been able to eliminate their air uh, So that's a pro tip. I totally meant to do that. Um, let's get these guys... Here. Don't look left or right, only forward. And we'll go ahead and get a few more supply depots as well to come set up here. Yeah, let's just, let's just go eliminate them. Ooh, okay. What we need here, or what I really want, is... No... I didn't realize that I don't have... Well, I don't even have an artillery brigade, but I don't have... Artillery tanks, but I do have half tracks. In the absence of orders, go find something and kill it. So we're gonna need our artillery brigade first, and then we can get 
our artillery half tracks out there and that's going to allow us to take them off from a distance without actually engaging them. Let's go ahead and set this up over back. here and then we can pull our artillery over here to start taking out this supply depot at least. It's one less thing. We're at 10 minutes, so I mean, we're making good time. Um, it seems to be going a lot faster than what it actually takes. I could, like, try to rush in and get it finished faster. Um, obviously, as is really true, I found in playing through the campaign, hitting them hard and fast before they have the chance to build up, like with that airfield. I mean, if you let that airfield go, it'll come bomb your core HQ, it'll bomb your troops, and if you don't have engineers to repair your buildings or to build anti-aircraft, um, not bunkers, anti... The anti-aircraft machine gun thingies, you know what I'm talking about if you play this game or if you've seen them uh, before, these things. A battery. Anti-aircraft battery. <laughs> That's the word I was looking for. Uh, to build those, you, you're really in trouble. It's very annoying. Um, oh boy, and they got light tanks already. So, definitely, if you can hit them hard and fast before they have a time to really regroup and um, get their stuff together and accumulate their forces, then it's hard. Did I send my artillery brigade down here? No, it was a supply truck. I can't remember if I did. Get moving, or I'll take command myself! Oh boy. Alright. Fall back. Resupply. These guys on this side. These guys on this side. There we go. Um, I'll get one just because now I think we've pretty much kind of almost won this, so I just want to get troops down here as fast as possible. Just gonna spawn these in to help out a little bit. No, 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 don't even go over there. There's flame tanks over there. Pretty heavy defense. Alright, so we're going to actually swing down here and wipe out their stuff down here because the enemy must be annihilated. If they keep sending, uh, as long as their divisions are there, they're going to keep sending troops. Okay, and I don't have enough money for that, so never mind. Um, they're just going to keep sending troops and it's going to be annoying, so we're going to go wipe it out. I'm gonna keep these guys here just to guard the supply depot just in case any troops come up through the top, but I don't really think it should be that much of an issue. Let's get them in here. There was more opposition here than I had originally thought. We're gonna try to take out everything we possibly can here.
completely forgot <laughs> that we had buddies here, so I'm gonna get them to, uh, let's get them over here. Maybe they can help us out. Right, we're gonna go ahead and pull these guys back. I just don't wanna lose anybody. Here's their core HQ down here. Just so you guys, when you, if you, when, if you play through this mission, you kind of know where things are. One mechanized infantry regiment to deal with all that. And they learned the hard way that that's not going to work. Actually, I'm gonna go ahead and pull these guys down here as well, just to help take this out. Take it out, these guys can take that out. And that should all work out really well, hopefully. Oh, he spawned in a new one. We gotta get it, we gotta get it, we gotta get it. We gotta hunt this truck down. No, we can't lose it. Wir beziehen Stellung. Okay. You guys go back and take, take the city back. March! Okay. So that's really disappointing. This Courage Q truck has escaped us. And I'm hesitant to. Don't look left or right. Only forward. Go after it and attack that depot. As you can see, there are multiple anti-tank regiments there, and I really don't want to... It's going to spread through our troops. Okay. And up here, we have taken this back. That's great. Los Leute, holt sie euch! Beginnt der Kampf? Schnell! Schnell! Einsatzbereit! Bringt 
line set up down here. So we have found their core HQ as well. Um, let's get these guys back here. sterben! Die sind uns nicht gewachsen. Einsatzbereit. Schnell! Schnell! We'll just slowly chip away at him. minutes uh, but that will 
hopefully help you guys out if you are stuck on that one or about to do it or whatever. Hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Peace.